gentlemen, welcome back to the church project and in this video today I'm just going to be showing you a little bit about reclaimed stone, the technique I use to back off and a little bit more about various techniques in the stone industry. So stay tuned and you'll see. My so when backing off reclaimed stone we always use a two and a half inch tungsten Riley and if you see how sharp I keep that and I only use it for two days. So to get my eye, my hammer five and a half inches which is 140 and when I angle the chisel in I rotate my wrist so we'll do this first piece and then you can see the technique I use for backing off if you see how I rotate my wrist as I angle the chisel in and it just helps it come off because you're going into the bed of the stone like so That leaves the stone with a nice flush back and that way it doesn't protrude into your cavity. So that is your face, very close into the face of the stone. And it's called punch face because of the indentations as we spoke about previously. So when the block was originally delved it will have been all rough like the back and they will have gone across the face using the chisel in motions like that to flatten it off and then they'll use like a point chisel to punch the indentations out I'm going to do what we call it as down the tooth where you go across the stones natural bed so I'm going to go down here and the stone should break off down there so I'll start going down the tooth See how that stone's broken down the bed and that way now I've got a facing out of the front and I've also got a piece of secondary out of the back which I'll now square up So that has now been refaced into a piece of secondary wall in stone or redressed or backings. So that way you're getting two for one. I ain't got a palette for that, so I'll just go like that with it. And last but not least, the technique I'm going to show you now is what we call scrappling, where we use the cutting edge of the maul. And the maul is a 14 pound hammer. Mine is very worn and I really could do with another one. So I'm going to go down at a striking angle across there with them all as I send it down I'll twist it at the same time and it should help remove that bed making it easier to back off easy as pie so thank you for tuning in today I just want to say a massive thank you to my lovely assistant Annabelle who's helped me thank you. got her out of bed at half past six this morning it's five this morning sorry come and help a dad so yeah thank you for all your appreciation and your support we're just over 81k now and i'm overwhelmed and i can't believe it so thank you everybody for tuning in and stay tuned for more